What's up everybody, this is Jake, and this is my interview with Ahmad Ferguson. He was the shooter that killed Ronnie in The Shy Season 3. If you didn't know who he was, that's him. And in this clip, he talks about graduating high school during a global pandemic, and also a little bit about how he got a little skills on the basketball court. Who knows, maybe one day we may see him showcase those skills. Nevertheless, let's hear what the brother got to say. Welcome to the stream, my brother. How you doing? I'm doing good. How you doing? I'm glad to be here. Hey, man. I'm glad to have you, man. I appreciate it. Even though you didn't hurt my heart, <laughs> I'm glad you're here. I ain't going to do you like Tariq. I mean, some people took that way too far with the Tariq, you know. <laughs> yeah. You know. So, a couple things before we get started, you know. So, in case people missed it, that's Samad Ferguson, young man. Um couple things you just graduated from high school recently right what's that all about yes sir so I recently graduated from a school in Indiana called Hammond Morton uh, I played basketball for four years um I was uh, I started my last two years I was the oh, guard so you can hoop huh oh yeah I can hoop hoop so uh, <laughs> yeah I went I, I just graduated recently you know so yeah yeah okay what was it like with the uh when the rona hit what did what did that do how did that affect you i mean um when it like my school like they was really straightforward with us they was like um uh, you know we might not have we might not have like the rest of the year so we just gonna start doing stuff at home but honestly i thought we were gonna come back because some teachers was like giving us like false hope like oh yeah we'll be back you guys be able to have a prom you know you guys be able to do stuff so I'm just like, okay, cool. But luckily, I went to prom my junior year, so I got that experience out the way, which was like, it wasn't that fun, but I, I enjoyed myself. But, yeah, they luckily, I got to play basketball, too, because, like, this year, I got some teammates that were juniors last year that's their, it's their senior year, and they might not even be able to have a season. So luckily, I got to I got to play basketball, do what I love in high school, you know. But it was just it was just wild. And, like, one day I just woke up, and they said, like, we weren't, we weren't going back at all. And... I would say for about an hour and 30 minutes, I was pretty sad having withdrawals, but I just took it for what it was and I understood and yeah, now we're here, so. Yeah, well, that's what's up, man. I appreciate that. My son, this is his, I got to think about it. I think this is, <laughs> <laughs> this is junior year. So mm -hmm. yeah, this is junior year. So man. I really, hope, I really hope everything comes back to normal before his senior year so he'll be able to enjoy it. Yeah, definitely, definitely. He was more of a homebody, so it didn't affect him as much. But I know if it would have been me during that time, I would have been, like, dying. Yeah. <laughs> so, you know, that's what's up.